So, you want to get the foul gold? You're in the right place. We're going to be going over all the 100 tasks, 10 in each category. Really just 10 long ones of getting the gun gold. First up, it kills. These are pretty basic. Just get a kill. It's a passive one. As you kind of go for the other ones, you'll get these. So you don't have to focus too much on this. You can do this in any game mode, but Shimmin, you can get kills really fast. Something like that. That counts. Next up is Woodland. Best game mode for this would be Hardcore Domination. If not, one of the shipments hardcore. Or if this game mode's not working out for you, you could do Ground War. Something like that counts. <laughs> good, good spawn. <laughs> Then we have crouch ones. These are also a passive one. As you focus on others, you can just get these. Play any game mode. Doesn't matter which. Shipment's just a fast and easy way to get kills. So I'm gonna go over to that. That counts. Just gotta crouch where you get your kill. Then we have dragon. You just gotta get hit fire kills. Also another passive one, kinda. But at some point you may need to focus on this if you just don't hit it too much. I do have a class setup for this if you'd like to copy this or anyway. The 5 milliwatt laser because it increases hit fire. Same with the Merc foregrip, increases hit fire. 30 round mag, because you're going to miss a few, so might as well just keep shooting. The stippled grip tape, so you can go to sprint to fire faster. And then no stock, so you can just move around faster, because you're going to be at disadvantage not being able to aim, so you might as well get close as you can. That counts. Then we have Splinter. You have to get long shot kills. Best gamble for this would be the Ground War or Shoot House. You could do it across the middle lanes in Shoot House or Ground War. You could be pretty much anywhere. There's a lot of places to get long shot kills from. I have a class setup for this one. Using the Compensator and Commander Foregrip to control for the recoil. XRK Marksman to get better range because you always need that for long shots. 30 round mags so you can keep shooting. And then the variable zoom so you can switch between 3 and 6.1 times zoom. It's just personal preference, but I just like to use this. Something like that would count. Just long shots far away, that's all it is. Now we have Topo. For these ones, you have to just get mounted kills. The game most for this one would be the Ground War, or you can even do it in Shipment. You're gonna die a lot in Shipment, but you're also gonna get the kills fast. It's up to preference, really, if you like Ground War or Shipment, but Shipment's pretty fast. You can use any attachments you want, but for what I used, I used a Compensator Panda Foregrip for the recoil, 5 mm laser, to just faster ADS so you can get mounted on the walls quicker. 30 round mag, keep shooting, stipple grip tape so you can get to the fire faster. Like, pull the trigger faster is what it does. Something like that would count. All you have to do is mount down, wait for someone, then shoot. Then we have Tiger. You have to get kills with all the attachments on, so five attachments, to get 180 kills. This is more of a passive one as well, because most of the time whenever you're playing the game, this gun, you're going to be using all the attachments, or you could copy whatever I'm using. If you need, you don't know your own attachments. It's all preference though, set up for your playstyle. For this one, I'd say shipment's pretty fast to do this. All you have to do is get some kills with five attachments on. As long as you have all your attachments loaded up, and you get a kill, it counts. For stripes, and you get 50 kills after reloading. It's about like one and a half second. When you get a kill in between that time, it counts towards the skin. You, the only thing that would help for this one would be using the perk sleight of hand. Doesn't take too long to unlock this one, but by the time you even get to the challenge, you should have it. Reload. I get a kill, that counts. Then we have Reptile. You have to get 110 kills with no attachments on your gun. Best game mode for this would be Hardcore Domination, maybe even Hardcore Shipment, because it gets, it gets it faster, but you will die a lot. As long as you have no attachments and then get a kill, it counts towards it. Something like that would count, that's all you need. Then for the last one, we have Skulls. It has to get three kills without dying. If you were to get three kills, it counts as one, six, it counts as two, and then nine, three. This is preference. Based off your attachments, this is what I use. Some that more fits your play style would change up your attachments. I use the Compensator Commander Foregrip to get the recoil under control of the 5 mm laser so you can go to ADS faster, 30 round mag so you can keep shooting, and the stippled grip tape so you can go to shoot faster. One, two, actually, <laughs> and then three. That counts as one towards the camo. Yeah, well, that's the end of this video. If you liked it, give it a like. If you didn't, a dislike input's always good. Change up my style based on like dislike, you know what I mean? And uh, yeah, got anything to add to this that I might have missed, put in the comments. And I don't know, what's your favorite number? One to ten. Yeah, that's pretty interesting, I guess. But then comments too, I don't know. Yeah, peace.